Hello and welcome to City Skyline Mods. Today I've got a few, uh, few cool mods for you. As you can see, I've got this Shaders mod on, which makes everything look absolutely amazing. Gives it like a cell shaded look, nice bit of bloom. So this one, to get all the options up in it, you need to press backslash and you get all of these. It won't start off with all of these on, so you will need to press backslash to get this up. Without it, it's just normal. Uh, then you put put this on, you have to click um, uh, edge detection, and then you click bloom to get all the really nice looking things. Um, so yeah, th this is a really nice mod that makes just your city look so brilliant. The only problem with it, it's a bit laggy, I'm only getting like 16 frames a second on this, but that's when I'm recording, I usually get 20 with it. It's not the best, but uh, it's better than the last one, um, last version where it had a lot of memory leaks, but the mod creator had fixed that for this one. A lot of different options in it, so you can get it pretty much stylized as uh, as you want. Uh, let's switch this off so I can get back to ooh, so much blue. Back to normal 25. Should get 30, but that might be because my city is massive. Uh, so, uh, second mod I gotta show you is City Vitals. It just basically has this up so you don't have to click, oh, where's my energy at? Where's my electricity? Where's my water? What's my sewage at? You know, it just kind of gives you the basics. Landfill, you know, I don't have to go into here and go into, oh, landfill's getting a bit a bit much, and what about electricity and all that. It just gives you a nice overview here. Um, it doesn't give any education or anything like that, but if the... If there was a update to this, I'd give it like which ones you want to actually look, uh, which stats you want to look at. But this is what is going on with it so far, and it's quite nice. The only problem with this is when you go into this uh, camera view and get out of it, it breaks it. So try not to go into camera mode when you're doing it. Also, you can move it around. Um, uh, and the last mod, I had a bunch of mods lined up, but uh, some of them didn't work, some of them, some of them just crashed my PC. Uh, trying to bring you the best and most stable mods. Um, so, last one is these oh, absolutely brilliant. The, <laughs> the microwave dishes that seem to collect energy, they're a SimCity 3000 thing. But what I've done with them was try and make uh, SETI, you know, the, the um, center of uh, interterrestrial searchy thing. I think that's what it is. Um, so you get this really nice model and uh, all the links will be in the description. I'm not using them for power, I'm just using them as uh, just decoration really. But I'd suggest getting this. Um, these will show up in your electricity here. If you switch them on, they, they're pretty good. I don't actually use them. <laughs> they they're look pretty. Just like a proper government official using all your money to get things that are completely useless up and running. All come to Mega City 1. Where all your money is used for useless shit. <laughs> so yeah, that's all the stuff that I've got to show. Unfortunately, two or three mods that I wanted to work didn't. Or the... I had this mod that basically spreads fire, but it spread, spread it too much and crashed my PC. And it said, you know, there, there's likelihood for it to... Oh, well, it crashed the game, not my PC. Uh, so yeah, the, I'm not going to show you any mods that is likely to damage your PC 
I'll test them out first, and if they're running okay on my PC, I, I'll show them. Um, so yeah, uh, that's all the mods I've got to show. Um, if anyone has mods they want me to check out, please put them in the YouTube comments or on the Reddit. Um, I don't mind, and I will check them out. Uh, otherwise, thanks for watching.